Hi, I'm Chen Gao from Virginia Tech, and today I'm going to introduce our work on Flow Edge Guided Video Completion. This is a joint work with Jabin from Virginia Tech, Ayush and Johannes from Facebook. Given a video and a customized mask, we aim to impaint the mask region with plausible content. Video completion can be leveraged for different purposes. We cluster them into two main categories. The first one is object removal. We can track the unwanted object and completely remove it. The second category is stationary mask in painting. The occluded region is at the fixed location. In this example, the video is corrupted by watermark, which is placed at the fixed location. We want to impaint the watermark region and recover the video. Proof is method in paint video frame by frame with plausible content. However, the completion is not temporal consistent. To maintain the temporal consistency, we complete the flow in the missing region and use the flow to propagate color. This is the overview of our method. The input is a video and the corresponding mask. We first predict and complete flow. Then we use flow to guide the color completion. Our core idea is to complete a high quality piecewise smooth flow field for propagation. Here in master could now synthesize sharp flow edges along the object boundary. Thus, our first contribution is an edge guided flow completion. We first compute the flow from the corrupted input video. We extract flow edges using candy edge extractor and then use a network to complete flow edges. The completed flow edges is labeled in red. Finally, we estimate the piecewise smooth flow field by minimizing the gradient everywhere in the missing region except along the edges. Later, we will use flow as a guidance to do color propagation. In the current frame, all pixels in the green region are missing. Our goal is to find temporal neighbor for each missing pixel. The right figure shows a space-time visualization for the highlighted scan lines in the left images. The video is a high by width by time tensor. We get the space-time visualization by slicing the tensor at y equals y prime. The yellow, orange, and brown line in the right image represent the scan line in different frames. The flow establishes a connection between related pixels across frames. We propagate color from no pixels to missing region along the flow trajectory. Here we illustrate the completion procedure for the red and blue pixels. By following the flow trajectory until the edge of the missing region, we obtain local temporal neighbors for the blue pixel. By tracing backward, we obtain backward flow neighbor. By tracing forward, we obtain forward flow neighbor. However, this does not work for the red pixel because the swiping lag form impassable flow barriers. Thus, we alleviate this problem by introducing non-local temporal neighbors, which is computing flow to a set of temporal distant frame that shortcut across flow barriers. With the help of non-local flow, we obtain extra non-local neighbors for the red pixel. Here we show the effectiveness of our non-local flow neighbors. By propagating color along the flow trajectory, we complete the video. However, direct propagating color results in visible seams. Thus, we propose to operate in the gradient domain for seamless results. For each missing pixel, we will have up to five candidates, the forward flow neighbor, the backward flow neighbor, and three non-local flow neighbors. For each candidate, we estimate a binary validity indicator and a confidence score. The validity indicator tells if a pixel has this kind of candidate. The confidence score tells how much we can trust this candidate. We fuse candidates in the gradient domain. The confidence score sums to one so that we can use it to weighted sum all candidates. We reconstruct image by Poisson reconstruction. We pick a frame with most missing pixel and impaint the frame with spatial impainting. 
the result will be passed into next iteration until there's no missing pixel. By operating in the grading domain, we obtain seamless results. Here I'm going to show more results. Our method can handle screen space masking painting. Freeform masking painting and object removal. Here is the quantitative results under the stationary masking painting and object masking painting setting. Our methods substantially improve the performance over state-of-the-art algorithms on all three metrics. Our master handles video up to 2K resolution, while other methods fail due to extensive GPU memory requirement. In summary, our core contributions are by explicitly completing flow edges, we obtain piecewise smooth flow completion. We handle regions that cannot be reached through transitive flow by leveraging non-local flow. We avoid visible seams by operating in the gradient domain. Thank you for listening. Please check out our webpage for more information.